Welcome back, Hunter Squats today. Today I want to talk about knee positioning when you're doing the squats. I see a lot of videos of people posting the 100 squats and their knees are coming forward quite a bit. So this video is going to show you how to keep your knees back. So you can imagine that there's a wall in front of your toes that comes up and your knees should never touch that wall. So the difference between doing these types of squats, keeping your knees back, as opposed to the other ones, is that with these squats, you start the squat by sticking your butt back. So butt goes back, and then the knees stay behind the toes. So my toes are right here. So there's a big gap right here between the knee and the wall. What you don't want to do is this. See how my knees go forward? You don't want that. You want to keep your knees back. And last thing about knees is you want to keep them wide. So feet straight, but knees wide. You're going to use your glutes and hips to turn the knees out. So wide knees. And what you don't want to do is have your knees come forward or even inwards. That's really bad. So that's terrible. And that's good. Probably the best stretch for getting your knees wide on the squats, preventing them from coming in, is this one. So you're going to come into lunge position, knee on the ground, this heel underneath the knee. Bring this elbow down as low as you can and just try and get down here and hold here. Hold for a good two minutes at least. And what you're gonna find after is when you do a retest on your squat is that this leg will be able to go so much further wide. So check it out. Wide knees.